my name is Beth Hyland here for Board Game Geek at Spiel 2016. I'm sitting down with Marco and Stefania. Hi. And then we also have Valerio. Hi. <laughs> and you guys are from Yaki and Nike. Yes. And you brought us a very big map of the Rhine River Trade. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, we are just working on uh, this game from uh, maybe three years. It's uh, our large pro project for uh, Essen uh, this year. And uh, we are uh, going to produce the game for uh, the US market with uh, the Vera US Publishing in Japan. We arrived in Japan with uh, ArcLight and of course in Italy and uh, all in Europe uh, by our distribution. <laughs> uh, we believe a lot on this project because uh, we started uh, many years ago with uh, two Italian designers, very well known uh, at the moment uh, for other uh, famous games. And uh, we are very proud about the result because uh, all our staff worked a lot uh, on uh, the graphic layout and the project. Well, I'm going to switch it over to you guys. Why don't you give us a quick overview of what are we trying to do in Yes, uh, yeah. this is uh, a game about uh, delivering goods uh, starting from Basel in uh, Swiss and uh, moving along the river, uh, river uh, Rhine up to Rotterdam and then to London. And uh, in, uh, the game is played over a fixed number of rounds and during each round uh, a player acquires orders and uh, this, uh, decide in which city they have to deliver goods and, uh, and how many turns they have at disposal for delivering. And uh, players as uh, some uh, means of transport for delivering goods, okay. Uh, but uh, the, uh, the, the transports are shared between players. So <coughs> there, um, you have to uh, you have to take a transport, but uh, probably you have to share the space on the transport with other players. Which means you might not quite get the route that you want. <laughs> yeah, also because during the game some transport are uh, on the road, somewhere on the road uh, in the middle of the Europe and you have, you have to choose among uh, the, uh, the transport that uh, are still in Basel. <laughs> so uh, there is uh, a lot of interaction some calculation because you have to optimize your your delivery trying to reduce the cost and to deliver it right in time and uh, sometimes you have uh, also to fight with the other players because i want this this transport leave me this transport please or leave me some space <laughs> don't leave without me yes. Well, yes. just taking a guess you know i'm, I'm looking here that I, I would say these symbols are how that city is connected that is connected by train is connected yes. by road is connected by water so Yes, oh. yes, yes, this is the meaning, but because uh, trains and uh, trucks uh, can connect all the cities uh, from Basel to Rotterdam, ships uh, stops just in the even cities and in Rotterdam, and uh, the plane is the only uh, mean that reaches London. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> so how do we determine who wins? Uh, it's, about, it's a game about money. You have to spend money in order spend to... Spend money to make spend money. Spend money and make money. <laughs> yes, yes. So, you have to move along this track, uh, keeping track of your money, the spending, and, and then gaining money. Yeah. You were just pushing a piece over there. The track. The track. The track. Yes, this, this, is, this is the only track. mean of transport that is your, but uh, is uh, is very expensive and uh, has uh, a very uh, little uh, load capacity. So. So let's give we'll give an example here of, of yes, uh, sort of what yes, your personal transport but, uh, might look like. Uh, a track can transport only two containers. Uh, uh, and uh, is is very expensive and uh, moves very slowly. Versus, and I'll, I'll uh, pull out one of the ships instance, here. Yes. So we can. For instance, this uh, this train can load up to ten containers and uh, can move. Uh, this uh, this is the speed, just two, 
This train is uh, the average train and move with speed 3. The fastest train move with speed 4, for instance. So usually it's better to take the train or the boat, <laughs> not the truck. <laughs> it's very environmental as well. <laughs> yes, yes. The plane is uh, more expensive. Yes, yes. obviously yeah. the, pra the plane is expensive. And uh, yes, Fast, this is this is this is environmental, and uh, this is also the truth because we uh, we had the the idea of this game during an holiday in Germany. <laughs> we were uh, in Mainz between Mainz and Koblenz, and we had uh, uh, the by idea bike. because we were <laughs> we were riding by bike along ah. the river, and uh, we saw the boat. And we probably we will uh, we were riding at the same speed of the boat <laughs> very very slowly. Oh, how many containers on the boat? Uh, and uh, there uh, there was also a train uh, running um, on the side of the huh. bicycle uh, path. So boat oh, train. train. Interesting. Could be a game. It's a game. <laughs> What a great inspiration yeah. for a game. <laughs> I hope the ho but, your holiday was enjoyable too. I like the game. I was going to say, I mean, uh, with the rest of us got a game of it, I hope you at least got a holiday out of it. <laughs> it's well, an odd job then, anyway. right? You know, it's an odd job. <laughs> well, I really appreciate you guys taking a few minutes Thank you. to give us a quick tour of Rhine River Trade. And uh, I'm very glad that you took that holiday so we all get a game out of it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.